Actually, I would, maybe partly as, as an advertisement and partly as an illustration of some of the things Areski and I were talking about, about the importance of form. I've mentioned a few times we're going to have a workshop that deals with stories, and I, by pure chance, happened to have in my pocket one of those uh, little toys. It's just um, a, a little piece of plastic, but its form is rather complicated and uh, mathematically designed, and it is designed to um, to behave in a in a rather strange way. It, by the way, it's called uh, rattleback, and it can be purchased uh, in toy stores. By the way, the toy stores are places where kids and physicists go to shop because physicists are big, big kids. But in any case, if I may show you how this works, um, here's what it looks like. It's, uh, it's a piece of object that if I rotate it one way, this way, which is counterclockwise from my point of view, it's very happy to rotate and, and the plastic is very smooth and the table is very smooth so it rotates for a long time. But if I try to rotate it the other way, it starts to rattle and reverses the direction of motion. So from clockwise it goes to counterclockwise. I'll demonstrate this one more time. And it goes back. So it's, it's quite an unusual behavior. And the secret is precisely in the form of this thing. So form is paramount. Uh, in, in, in toys, in inanimate things, and of course in living things, in organisms, um, at various scales. And this is what our program is all about.